outside of the mountain for that is that is a documented uh, is a uh, factory location only which uh, all of three are at uh, home king or uh, even in the latest uh, we have uh, even that right yes. so this query has been responded to yes hey, responded to right now after over few over period of time when they assimilated with the surrounding well, it's part of indic culture yes. now the part okay. this is our initial passage okay. this is not originally uh, <laughs> He made the dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here they are putting the uh, body, whole body. Yeah. But is the body and of the king, not, king, of, the, yeah, not of the ordinary king. citizen. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah. This is all royal. So we are here on a site visit uh, to the Maidams, which are the burial mounds of the Hom dynasty. Uh, I would like to thank uh, Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi and Honorable Chief Minister of Assam, Hemant Biswa Sharma, for promoting Assamese culture and world heritage to international countries and places all over the world. Uh, the Government of India has taken a call to nominate this uh, site on the World Heritage List and for that purpose uh, we are endeavouring and making our efforts. I congratulate the Government of Assam, the officers of the Ministry of Culture, Archaeological Survey of India and the Archaeology Department of the State of Assam for preserving and conserving this uh, extremely important world, extremely important site which is being proposed to be inscribed on the World Heritage List. We hope it gets inscribed and uh, it's part of uh, the proud Assamese culture. <clears throat> we see an involvement of the youth of the local area. The Assamese youth are also involved. We see the tourist guides uh, for the tourism purpose. A lot of Assamese youth have been employed and this is a step in the right direction when the youth and the local community gets involved in the preservation and conservation of a cultural heritage. It shows that how important a cultural heritage is for the people. And Prime Minister Modi has said, Vikas bhi or virasat bhi, which links our past with our future. And uh, we thank everyone here, especially our friends in the media who had to stand in the sun to wait for our visit to get over. And thank you very much. Sir, uh, it has a great historical significance as well as it is very important for the uh, Northeastern uh, history. Uh, we are very much hopeful. What are the probabilities of uh, induction in the World Heritage Site? Uh, <clears throat> there is a process for uh, inscription on the World Heritage List and that process is being followed by the Government of India and the Archaeological Survey of India under the 1972 Convention of UNESCO. Uh, the probability is high but uh, I don't want to make any comments right now because that is the prerogative of the World Heritage Committee. So I don't want to preempt, but uh, I'm very hopeful and there's a lot of pleasure in my heart. Sir, again, uh, someone is visiting after you. I wish, well, a lot of people do visit. Uh, once it gets inscribed, uh, eventually it will become a major tourist attraction. And today, Charai Deo is known uh, to the people of Assam, to the people of India. Uh, very soon, it will be known to the whole world. And this is the pride of the Assamese culture where the Ahom kings are buried and you can see the spirit of the Ahom kings is still alive, the spirit of the Assami culture is still alive and I request people from all over, from all over India, do not travel outside India, please visit Indian World Heritage sites like this and visit the Assami site and it's so beautiful and you get inspired, thank you. Thank you.